time at the moment and we're um, going to the sunrise at the beach. I look a bit better than my mama. I look a bit better with the sunglasses on. I look like I'm a week. So I'm gonna do this until around 7 because I have a cut to do. So at 7 I'll go have breakfast after then go back to my room and do my cut. Yeah, well, let me show you the fun right. I will try to make move your phone. Oh, yeah. I'm having quite a heavy breakfast because I'm about to go to class until 11 and I won't have time to eat. Morning. Eh, eh. It's in the middle, so I have um, ham, I have bacon, I have chicken sausage, I have egg toast, I have croissant, I have a cinnamon roll I have my omelette <laughs> the waffle and two juices so yeah I'm eating quite heavy hi guys I'm currently having I'm currently in class um, and my cut has been postponed so I'm thinking I should make this class and just go and have fun because I'm really in a vacation and I don't want to be in class but yeah and I've actually never missed a class mm. I've never missed this class today, so I think I'll miss it. I want to leave when I'm done preparing. I want to go swimming. Um, I think my sister is currently alone and I want to join her. Because uh, my mom is back in her room, so she's just resting. My brother and my cousin are still having breakfast, so I think I'll just join my sister. Then after this, um, at around 2 p.m., we're going to go for boat riding and yeah. I'll show you guys when we get there, but for now, let me go swim because I need half fun. fun at the other beach so now we're back at Congo River again but this time we drove here because we just went straight from the other beach to Congo River but first <laughs> I need to play with these waves then I think we'll go for a boat ride on the river okay, so we're going for the boat ride over there I don't even know 
wants to play with it who he was so what you do with what the majority want anyway can't wait to see the end of this river So I have a fish plate. I have a fish called barakuni or something. I'm sorry if I got it wrong. A naan and curry. And another beef eat. Rice, smoky mo. And beef stew. Yeah, and water and wine. Morning. It's the 10th of December. This is our last day over here. Last day as we're traveling today. So, um, it's 6 or 8 a.m. as usual. Oh, I can feel it from my face. It's a big monkey. Anyway, as usual, we're here to catch the sunrise, but this time just me and my cousin. The rest, the rest wanted to sleep in today. So, yeah. I'm about to have some photo shoot. Last minute photo shoot. I'm recording this long just in my beautiful. Yeah, anyway, I'll let you know how it goes. Okay, and today's plate, last, I think, the second last meal of the day. Um, watermelon, pineapple, um, we've got some bacon, some egg toast, some croissants, chicken sausages, cinnamon roll, and ham. Korea. <laughs> 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 It's almost like, so now I'm going to teach you my language. So, I know there's a problem with my audio, I don't know what's happening, but this is my audio. But yeah, um, there's a problem with it, I've noticed, I have noticed. And I don't know what happened to the body. But, um, yeah, so this is basically the outro for the Diani trip because I was way too tired to do an outro when I came back actually to shoot a video on the way back and the review and all that oh my god I was way too tired so I'm gonna do it today like two weeks later <laughs> and you can see I've changed locations I'm no longer in Nairobi um 
I know some of you will notice this area <laughs> if you watched my videos earlier this year. But anyway, so this is a, re a review for Southern Palm Beach Resort. So, well, let me just tell you when we when we left, um, we had since we had paid for for all inclusive, so we had packed lunch. Um, what was um, what was packed was. Okay, it was different for each of our boxes so some of us had fish some of us i had chicken okay let me just talk about my box i had chicken i had um a banana i had two queen cakes i had a croissant i had uh uh i think two croissants if i'm not i think one croissant i had a sandwich and i had a juice box yeah i think that was it for me actually I had the most <laughs> coincidentally <laughs> but yeah uh, so although when we left they gave us four boxes and we were five so my mom we just had to remember I had to pick from each of our boxes so that wasn't really nice of them uh, you know people make mistakes um overall the service is the best it's a four-star hotel but I think honestly it should be a five-star hotel it was really nice so uh, the the workers there are very kind, they are very friendly, you know, they always say hi to you when you pass by, they always try to engage you with stories, even when you're serving, you know, they keep on asking you, are you okay, are you good, you know, the service is really nice, the workers are really nice, they're really kind, they're really, really friendly, um, what else, the food, um, the food was quite nice, it had, um, um, it had, um, a section for Indian food. It had all these other sections. It had, it had, it was amazing. It it had vegetarian food. It had all these other foods. Yeah, I got to try turkey for the first time. Um, pretty basic. I, I don't see the people take that every year, <laughs> but yeah, pretty basic for me. Um, the cuisine was quite nice. So if you had an all-inclusive package. You could eat literally at any time really you want, depending on what restaurant is open. So the first the main restaurant, you know, where you go to take a breakfast, lunch, dinner. Then there's a, a pool bar where you can have your drinks in the pool. There is now a snack bar where you can have now your meals. You can have pizzas, that's the snacks, pizzas, burgers, fries, you know, all that. So. As we, we had to, we used to have our meals, breakfast and dinner at the main restaurant. Then lunch we'd have, we'd, we'd have it at a snack bar. On the beach, yeah, it was really beautiful. Mm, yeah, so you wouldn't get hungry at any point in the hotel if you have all inclusive. It also included alcohol, so that was nice. Um, there's one thing though, okay, oh wait, the room. So I hope you guys can see me. The room. The rooms are beautiful. We didn't have um we didn't have the a beach front a beach view in a room but because you have to be more but we were like literally next to the beach front view. Beach front beach view rooms or what do we call them? Yeah. <laughs> We were literally, like, literally next to them, so we could see like a glimpse of the beach, which was nice. My mom's room had a most um, view of the beach, which was quite pretty and it was quite nice for us. That was first way for them to do that. Um, what else? So the rooms are really nice. The bathroom is well maintained. Very really nice. The bathrooms are clean. Um, you had toiletry. You had towels. The room was beautiful it was spacious you had your own desk you had the dressing table you had like an extra chair and you see in the room it's really nice the balcony has also chairs and the table <sighs> it was amazing mm, what else mm, there's one thing there's one thing they need to work on and that's the drinks like i'd give everything a five out of five but the drinks i'd give the drinks like a three out of five maybe you get alcoholic drinks, yes, but you only get local alcoholic drinks. So, <laughs> the drinks I never even saw before. <laughs> but, 
they should work on the dates like they should work on the cocktails they should work on the um, mocktails yeah they were it's really nice but bearable but that's one thing they should work on other than that i think everything else is fine really everything else is fine it was literally at the, at the beachfront so everything else is fine yeah so that's it for Scott and Palm Beach Resort and what else oh my god i had a scary experience when we came back see at the sgr the way there's a yellow line you told not to cross <laughs> so there's literally that small space between the sgr the train itself and the pavement <laughs> do you know a baby literally fell inside that hole eh? <laughs> and my mother wasn't even crying maybe if it was my baby i'd cry <laughs> i'd freak out but the mother was cool even the, the, the whole crew was the whole crew was, <laughs> was a bit cool oh it's hot we're trying to make trips i think it's turning out okay the whole crew was cool they got the baby out in literally minutes like in a minute yeah uh they, during the oh the train was uh, so this nigerian guy is sitting in front so uh, annoying annoying but you know we deal with them the way you want to Anyway, I'm talking too much now, so um, I think I'll have to put a pattern on too because it's taking too long. So anyway, I enjoyed my stay there. I'd give a wish for the which was a five-star resort because it is it. It really does. Anyway, mm, mm, really good. Really good. <laughs> anyway, if you haven't had lights the whole day, it's just come back. Anyway, <laughs> thank you guys for watching. Um, if you want to see more of these travel videos, let me know or to suggest um, places where you'd want to, me to go. You know, to review guys, to review it for you guys. Yeah, because uh, 2021, we must get money. We must get money to do what? We must get money to travel. Amen. 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 <laughs> anyway, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Bye.